A delegation comprising of the executive members of the Khas Hills Autonomous District Council and leader of the opposition Pinchingan MCM, under the leadership of the chief executive member of the council Titos Khan, had met Chief Minister Conrad K. Sangmao on Monday, 7th February 2022, to discuss on important issues concerning the KHADC. Addressing news reporters after the meeting, CEM of the KHADC, Titos Khan, expressed his gratitude to the Chief Minister of the State on the government's response to the present Executive Council after the election of Lamprang Bla as the new Chairman of the Council. Further, Khan informed that the government has also clarified on the recommendations made by the KHADC with regards to the proposed amendment to the sixth schedule of the Indian Constitution. Uh, actually, first of all, the meeting is a courtesy meeting after the new election of the new chairman of the council, Mr. Lam Pangla. So as a all MDCs, including the leader of opposition, we met the Honorable Chief Minister to express our gratitude to his support of the government to the present executive committee. And actually, at the same time also, we got some issue to discuss with him, especially regarding one issue of the proposed amendment of the six schedule. As you have seen in the last uh, meeting of the UDA, we have uh, decided to meet him today to seek a clarity regarding the proposed amendment. What are the views of the government regarding the, this proposed amendment? So I would like to inform you that the Honorable Chief Minister has given us a clear clarity about the proposed amendment that uh, especially regarding the village council. He has uh, given a clarification that uh, in the proposed amendment approved by the cabinet, the word village council is also being included with the word village dorba as applicable. That means in Garo Hill, they may accept the word village council, but in Tasi Jaita Hill, the word village Darbar is applicable. So the question of village council in Tasi and Jaita Hill does not arise. So that is a full clarity we got from the government. And at the same time also, we had uh, given us the assurance that uh, uh, before the amendment was placed in the next session, autumn session. I think we'll be having a meeting in Delhi along with the Honorable Chief Minister, uh, the CEM of all the council. We will be leaving to Delhi and to have more discussion regarding this matter. We would like to ensure from our side that the word village Darbar should not be managed, should not be removed. All traditional practice, all traditional religion should be strengthened as per the new amendment of the Constitution.